So if we start some of the misconceptions with regards BPH, uh, and this is a common one that I see with many men that present to the clinic, really is that they feel that the development of urinary symptoms is associated with prostate cancer. One of the key things to be aware of with a prostate is, in essence, it's shaped a little bit like a donut and we pee through a hole in the middle of the prostate. The part of the prostate that grows as we progress through life is the part that surrounds the outlet pipe. And so for the majority of men, the development of urinary symptoms tends to be associated with benign enlargement rather than cancer. Prostate cancer, when it does occur, tends to occur or arise in the outer part or near the shell of the prostate, and so really needs to be quite large in its size before it causes any urinary symptoms. So myth number one basically is the evolution of urinary symptoms is related to prostate cancer. That's not necessarily the case. Although BPH, benign prostatic hyperplasia, is far more common as men progress through life, it is also possible that men can develop urinary symptoms at a younger age. And BPH, in fact, can begin to show signs in the early 40s. 